Hi guys, how are we? I can only apologize for not uploading for the past month, couple months. I just had a little break from YouTube because I've been busy. I've been a busy girl. I launched a new business. I went away. I went away again. I'm about to go away again tomorrow. Living living a lovely summer life already, but that's just meant I've been super busy with other things. So I didn't get a chance to upload this video. So this video is from the beginning of May when I went to Ibiza with my mum. I really hope you enjoy it has had a lovely time and if you're going away soon then hopefully it can give you a little excitement for your own holiday i do have another vlog coming after this another holiday vlog from when i went to morocco last week and i'm gonna have another one from when i'm going to malta this week and i have a haul as well that's coming so hopefully it'll be more consistent uploads from now i hope you're all well i hope you're happy i hope you're having a great time and i hope you enjoy this video so let's get into it what was this hand movement let's get into it <laughs> I can't talk, I'm too tired, so we'll have to talk when I get to the destination. Okay, hi guys. Welcome, welcome to my channel. If you've never been here before, my name is Emma Thompson Hill. Thank you for joining me today. I am in Ibiza. I'm on my holiday with my mum yet again. We just got here, we flew so early this morning. Oh my goodness. It was like stupidly early. I think it was like 6 a.m. but because there's been loads of queues and stuff at the moment at the airport, they told us to get there three hours before, which would have been 3 a.m. but my mum is like so particular. So we, I think we got there at like half two, quarter past two. No, I think it ended up being about two o'clock-ish. So, yeah, I had had no sleep. If you watch my last video um, where I packed, you'll know all about it. I didn't sleep. I basically, nothing was open at Manchester Airport. Like not even people were on the counters at duty free. Like it was like, help yourself. Um, obviously they were at the till, but like not on the actual counters. Um, no restaurants were open until like 3 a.m. Oh, it was just a mess. We had a little bit of food. Um, I ended up sleeping on a sofa i didn't i didn't have the brain power to talk to you guys that early this morning so i slept on a sofa for like an hour and a half then we got on the plane i literally slept the whole entire plane ride which was kind of good um so i've only had a few hours sleep i definitely could have another nap but we're here in ibiza and i'm so excited i haven't been here since i came with nasty gal back in 2019 and ibiza is just such a beautiful place i love the island so let me give you a little room tour this is our room it's messy right now so you have the toilet right here then the bathroom which i really like it's like massive mirror i love that it has this because then i can hide all my shit that's my mum's stuff um the robes mirror everything like that big huge shower this is the room me and my mum got a little single beds each wardrobe yeah it's just simple we've got a telly here a little desk down there and then we just have like a little coffee machine and everything like that. I might even have a coffee, you know, because I think I need it. And then out here, mum's out here. You wave at me vlog. Out here we have a little balcony and this is the view. So we're right by the water. It looks so beautiful. The hotel downstairs, what we've seen so far in the lobby, looks so nice. So I think I'm just going to unpack my suitcase. <laughs> what are you saying? She's saying Nikki Beach is over there. You say, you keep saying it. You say you don't want to go, but... <laughs> Why not? I don't know what Nikki Beach is. Beach. Like Ocean Beach. Yeah. Why not? We're not far. We're actually staying in Santa Lulia. Oh my God, is he looking at me? What fucking vlogging on my fucking camera? There's a man down there and I was obviously talking quite loud. And he went like this. He looked up at me like I'm like <laughs> Sorry, honey, it pays the bills. We're staying in Santa Lulia. Um, which is like the other part of the island, so it's not San Antonio, like um -ta, um -ta, um -ta. it's the more chilled part of the island, but it's just beautiful. So I'm gonna unpack my suitcase and then we're gonna go go for an explore of the hotel.
so I've left my camera in the room because it's charging, but we've basically booked up this hotel to have the prestige, which means that we can go on the roof, there's a pool on the roof, and this like lounge where all the food and drinks are free. Well, it's not, it's included. Let me show you. Old water, we have a coffee machine. This is like tea. All of these like help yourself. Um, off cold wine and champagne. Is that a beer? And that's water. Oh my God, I'm so impressed. Juice. We've got some juice and coke and stuff down there. Oh, and then there's food over here. I'm on the wide angle on my phone, so I hope this is not weird. Little sandwiches and olives. Oh, and some water. Oh, oh I love that one. Yogurt and fruit. Wow. So this is the roof. All down here is the sea. And that's like the main pool down there. It's so pretty. Are you happy? Yeah. <laughs> I want to get in the water so bad. In the ocean water. It looks really clear. I want to get in. I actually can't go over how beautiful it is. Let me show you my outfit. I'm just wearing these new look jeans, wide legged mum kind of jeans, and then I'm wearing this boohoo top. My camera's run out of battery, so let me show you my outfit. New look boohoo ASOS image gang. My shoes, they're my mum's, they're from Primark actually. We're just gonna go for dinner now, just in the hotel because we're both still really tired, so we're gonna get an early night tonight. So, dinner in the hotel, then bed. Good morning everyone, it's Sunday, I feel like I'm losing track of the days already but just woke up and come for breakfast. We went to bed at 10 o'clock last night and I literally woke up at like half past nine and my mum was dogging me like, get up, we need to have a breakfast. She's just, yeah, she's coming with a coffee now. Thank you. This is needed because it was still hard to wake up this morning. Yeah, I'm still tired, so I feel like I'm just readjusting. I'm still waking up right now. I'm a little bit grumpy. The weather's really nice today. I'm not gonna lie, the forecast says that it's gonna rain the whole week. So I'm hoping and praying that it actually doesn't do that and the weather stays nice. So yeah, I think today it'll just be another day of like chilling lounging by the pool i really want to get in the ocean because it just looks so nice we went on a little walk yesterday and we saw it and it looks so cute so i think i want to like try and get down there it's not really a beach it's just like little bits so i think i might try and get down there and get in the ocean i'm hoping it's not too cold because i went in the pool upstairs yesterday and it was freezing cold so i'm actually vlogging in public guys i hope we're proud of me because sometimes it can be awkward but here i am doing it pool upstairs yesterday was freezing cold so i'm not doing that again maybe i'll get in the actual pool down here which might be a bit better but yeah just gonna have breakfast right now this is where i want to be so it's just about getting there okay i just climbed down these stairs it was definitely a little bit scary but we did it. And this is what I'm greeted with. There's nobody here. I wore trainers because I knew that it was like pebbly down here. So I've, I've brought my sliders as well, just in case. I think I might sit on here. Me and my mum were saying we need to get some like, rock, like sea shoes or just some sort of shoes that like for walking in pebbles and shit like that. Hello gang, I've just had a shower and got dressed, blow dried my hair, this is the best thing that I ever bought, like a blow dryer brush, 
just gives you like a, a salon blow dry every time. Today, we have literally just been sunbathing. So obviously I went to the little beach and then I came back to have a little bit of lunch upstairs on the roof um, and then stayed up there for a little bit, got too hot, went downstairs to the pool, got in the pool, sunbathed there for a little bit, then came back to the room. I've burnt myself today, quite bad. But I feel like I do this every holiday, like I never learn. The thing about me is, um, I have to burn. Like, <laughs> I don't gradually go brown, like I'm quite a pale person, but when I burn, like in a couple of days, it's fine. So I sort of have to burn and then it just goes brown. My chest and my face is completely white still. This just doesn't make sense, but my legs are burnt, like my tummy and my back and my bum cheeks. Um, but what I'm, I was planning to fake tan tonight anyway, because I feel like I'm just looking quite pale and I need a bit of backup reinforcement. So what I'm gonna do right now is just put on a bit of concealer and stuff before we go for dinner. So I'm just gonna go, can I be asked? I actually don't know if I can be asked to put on makeup, but at the same time, I kind of want the picture and I look a bit dead. Let me just use this Glossier concealer. Yeah, that evens out the dark circles. I really can't be able to make up, so that's all I'm gonna do. Glossier concealer, and then lip balm, and brush my eyebrows up a little bit. In fact, I might do a bit more brow, so it stands out a bit. I respect it, I love it, but I actually have no idea how people do full faces on holiday, because I just simply couldn't be asked. I mean, I get it if you were like going somewhere, but maybe it's because I don't go nowhere. Like I'm literally going to the downstairs in the hotel. What's the point of putting on makeup? But maybe I'm lazy. Definitely I'm lazy. I mean, I did my hair and that's more than enough for me because usually I don't even do that. Olaplex oil, just to calm the frizz. My hair's super long again, guys. Like I had it cut in Feb, although I didn't have that much taken off it. I only had a couple inches off it, but it's just quite long. I was scared after I got it balayaged that the condition would be bad, but I don't think it is at all. In fact, I think I might, I could do with a bit more blonde in it. I might get my hair done soon because I kind of want some layers, long layers, because I feel like that would be cute because at the moment it's all one length. I feel like maybe some shaping would be nice, but I know nothing about hair. So maybe like some long layers, just some sort of cute hairstyle. So like when I do a little blow dry on it, it looks really cute. Maybe something like that. Okay, for the outfit, I put on these glasses just to, I probably won't wear these like for dinner, but they're just gonna be for a picture. Um, these glasses are from ASOS. This is such a good holiday outfit for me because it's just classy and simple. The jog is on misguided and the top is Primark and I've just got on my Gucci flip flaps. And then, same jewellery as always. I love these nails that I got. Oh my god, the whole time my camera, my camera lens isn't shutting and opening properly. Oh, they're cute. Um, gonna go for dinner now. Just gonna go to the buffet downstairs because that's where my mum wants to go. Hopefully, tomorrow, I'm gonna force her to leave the hotel and try somewhere local. Um, I don't know what's around us, so I think tomorrow I might go on a walk. So maybe we can go on a walk and explore. Me and you, I mean, me and you, um, and see what's around. Good morning. It's actually, what day is it, Mommy? Wednesday? Tuesday. Oh, okay. So I didn't actually vlog yesterday because it was, we didn't do anything, did we? It was overcast, so we didn't sit out. Hill. I went on a walk. That was about it, wasn't it? But what we're doing right now, we're making iced coffees because we're upstairs in the lounge and we figured out how we can make iced coffee, which is just putting the coffee in a glass of ice. <laughs> so yeah, today we're gonna go to Santa Lulia um, on a boat and we're gonna go and have some lunch there and just have a little explore, which will be nice. It's overcast again today, which is not the best, but actually it's probably for the best because we did get burnt every day. So maybe it is for the best that it's cloudy. We're gonna do that today. I'm just gonna go to the room and finish editing my video. Drink my coffee, we've just had breakfast. And that's it. This is a, a boring super BB cream. 
This is like super lightweight, it's just a BB cream, but it gives a flawless finish. Like it's like a foundation even though it's not. It's like skincare and foundation all in one. Love it. Super quick as well, you can mix it in with your hands and everything. <laughs> So, me and mum just got on a boat and we're in Santa Lulia town. So this is what we're doing today. It was overcast all morning, but the sun's come out a bit, which is nice. So I think our plan really is just to explore, go for some food. I'd like an ice cream. And an ice cream cone. Look how beautiful. So we just came on like a ferry. Um, that one over there that's leaving. You can get the ferry to like Ibiza or Santa Lulia or went to a couple other places, didn't it? Yeah. You can even get it to Formentera. Good morning everyone, it's Wednesday. I keep forgetting to vlog. So last night we went, we got on the, the ferry to Santa Lulia. We had such a nice dinner. No, we had, it was like a late lunch, wasn't it, Mum? Yeah. It was so nice. We had like, like ham and cheese croquettes. And then we had, what was it? Russian potato salad with octopus on top. And calamari and yellowtail sashimi and a bottle of wine and it was so nice and we got the nicest ice cream i honestly want to go back just to get the ice cream from the man because it was like proper gelato we came back on the ferry so nice we're a bit pissed aren't we because we had some sangria before we got on the boat and then um yeah we came back and got some dessert from the hotel and that was it went to bed didn't we we were in bed really early last night um and then now it's wednesday and look outside it's raining. Yesterday and the day before, it was like rain, no, it was um, cloudy, overcast, and then it got a little bit sunny at some points in the day, whereas today it's just pure rain. But we want to go to the market today. So we'll see, we're still gonna go, aren't we? We'll see what happens. We're about to go for breakfast now. Yay. <laughs> I've been making my own breakfast sandwiches, but they didn't have any fried eggs today, so I just put scrambled eggs in it. Orange juice, churros, pan and chocolate, coffee. Hello, my love. I feel like I've been a bit of a bad vlogger because I've been forgetting to pick up the camera because I've been making TikTok vlogs. Um, so I've been vlogging all everything on there, but I feel like I've been forgetting to pick up my big camera. So hi, it's now Thursday. So today's our second to last day, so yeah, I woke up again and it's cloudy again. It was cloudy on Monday, then we got up, it was like cloudy with a bit of sun, Tuesday cloudy with a bit of sun, Wednesday, yesterday it was raining all day, yeah we didn't get any sun yesterday and then today's supposed to be cloudy with a bit of sun, so it's not all bad. I mean I've definitely still got a tan because my sunburn has turned brown now, which I love, so I'm feeling like I've still got a tan, um, and then tomorrow's supposed to be really sunny so yeah yesterday we just went to the hippie market it was so cute we actually thought we really even considered not going because obviously it was raining but the rain laid off a bit and we decided to go and it was actually so busy and it was massive i think it's one of the bigger ones on the island so it's the one in i think let me find the name of it it's called hippie market punta arab arabai punta arabai um so yeah it was really good i ended up getting a hair clip i'll have to show you guys that later on i got a hair clip. well i reluctantly made my mum buy me a hair clip she didn't want to bite me but this lady like she had them all on the table and she showed me how to put it in and i was like that's so cute let me show you a picture of it isn't that adorable so i'll show you how i put that in later it's super simple um yeah that's what we did and then we just came back had some food had a drink 
and went to bed. We've been going to bed at like 10 o'clock every night, haven't yeah. we? Catching up on a lot of sleep, which is good. That's exactly what, it's what you come away for really, isn't it? Um, hopefully by about two, three o'clock, it's gonna get sunny, which is good. But today I might do a bit of a content day. So I'm gonna go for breakfast and come back up and sort of see the outfits that I wanna shoot. I'm upset, mum, because my tripod broke her. I sort of brought my tripod and just took myself off yeah. and done it myself. Mum, you, you don't really like taking my pictures, do you? No. <laughs> but mum, this, what you don't understand is, this is what sustains my career and this is what's gonna put you in a nice nursing home. I don't mind taking one or two pictures, it's when I have to take 30 or 40 of the same thing. But, it's but that's what you have to do, Mummy. Two pictures ain't going to cut it. I'm going to probably have my eyes closed on both of them. Surely, you know, after about five or six you've got the shot. Why do we have to take 50 of the same thing? Because, Mum, I need variations. Anyway. Long story short, I might come back upstairs and plan some outfits I want to shoot. Because I'd and do that when the sun comes out and then we can sunbathe. We will see how many I want to shoot. So that's the vibes. Look at my cute ankle bracelet. I need to get my toes done. Like I had them done a few weeks ago, but I got black French. So it, it was definitely a decision. Um, I had black on my nails and then I was like, oh, let me get matching. So I got black French, but now I'm really over it. I want white French back. I might have to do that when I get back to Manchester. So that's what we're doing today and I've literally this is the only t-shirt I brought you know I said I wanted to pack light I didn't bring a hoodie or a sweatshirt or, even though I usually would and I definitely have ne needed it and I don't have it and this is the only t-shirt I brought and like I've basically been wearing t-shirt every day so the pe people around here must think I'm I've got, I don't know must think I'm a right tramp this is a bodysuit from forever 21 years ago and I take it on every holiday because it's so comfy and then Gucci flip flaps and this is from H&M. I'm currently booking my hotel and flights for Malta. So I'm going to Malta in June with my two friends, Antonia and Lauren, who are also influencers, if you guys, you guys might know who they are. Um, but we're going to this festival in Malta. It's called DLT. Um, and it's like WizKid is going to be performing. Who's playing? I don't even know who's playing. They was just like, you wanna go on Malta on this trip? I was like, I'm down. I'm down for anything this summer, honestly. So, let me see. Okay, Wizkid, Kate Trinada, Shensia. There's a few, Western. There's a few different people. But I'm really just going for like the partying aspect. And then if we see some artists, then great. Definitely gotta go see Wizkid. Yeah, that's gonna be exciting. So I'm just booked the flight for that now. The fl flights are so expensive. And it's cause like, when you put a hold bag in, just gets so expensive the flight is pretty much costing the same as so basically we'll go in there and then in your package with the festival like you get a hotel and everything but we're gonna go two days before and we're gonna stay for two days after so we just booked our hotels for that as well so my four nights in hotel before and after the festival is the same price as my flight there anyway I'm paying for that right now is it going through let me check a bit oh okay it's done that flight, I'm flying at 5.40, which is even earlier than the flight I got here. Jesus Christ, I probably won't be able to sleep again. 5.40, so that means I've got a 5.43, 3.40, say I get to the airport for three o'clock. I might just do that thing where I stay up again because the, the good thing about staying up was that I basically slept the whole plane ride here to Ibiza, which I like. So maybe I could do that again. Like maybe have a nap the day before and then just stay up and then just sleep the whole time um, on the plane because the flight's a bit longer. The flight's like three and a half hours, I think. But I'm also going to Morocco, so I need to book my flight to Morocco as well. Let me just look at the flight prices for that. The sun's actually coming out now a bit. It's been cloudy all morning. It's like, what's the time now? Half 12 and the sun's coming out a little bit. So I'm actually gonna go up on the roof. Morocco. Oh my god, the price of this flight. 300. Oh my god, the flight times are diabolical. It's so bad. <laughs> 10 past 6 flight in the morning. I need to stop getting these 6 a.m. flights. It's not for me. It's not for me. Um and then 10:30 flight home. What? 450 quid, I'm not fucking paying that. Sorry, are you fucking off your head? 
But listen, Emma, it's not about the money. It's about the memories. You know what I mean? That 400 quid, uh, will I be thinking about that in 20 years? I think, oh, remember that time in 2022 when I went to Morocco? That's how I have to think about it or else I'll just cry. <laughs> I hate this. This is my bikini for today. Um, it's from We Are We Wear, the one I showed you in my last video. I love these bikinis. They're so nice. I have sun creamed my whole body. Yes, I have. Um, yeah, and I'm going to go to the roof and lie down for a little bit. Maybe listen to a podcast. You know, all of them vibes there. Maybe catch a little bit of a tan. And I have like thoroughly applied my sun cream. So hopefully I don't burn. Friday, it's our last day in Ibiza. Yesterday, it ended up being really sunny, so it was good. Got a cute tan laid out for a bit. Today, same prerogative. Like, we're just gonna lie out, get some sun. But also, today's gonna be a bit of a content day, so I've got some stuff I wanna shoot. Usually, I do this on holiday. Like, if we just chill out, then I'll do one day where I take, like, quite a bit of photos, um, just so it's done. Um, so, I've got, like, maybe couple bikinis and maybe three outfits or four outfits that I want to shoot so what I think I'm going to do is go and have breakfast first I might go and lie upstairs and just plan what I'm going to do for a little bit because I want to wash my hair and curl it and do a bit of makeup so I haven't figured out yet just my plan but I'm going to figure it out over the next hour or so and I'll bring you with me that's to be done this is my outfit um wear my we are we wear bikini again um, this is just from Primark. These shorts are from Misguided. I love them. They're just so comfy. And I'm just gonna wear my sliders. That's about it. Okay, I've come outside on my little recce to try and find locations to take pictures. All around here is super cute. This could all work. Look. Wow. A little bit of sun, a little bit of greenery. It's what England needs badly. Just shot this outfit and this pink bikini just back over there i'll flash some pictures up this is what we took with mum <laughs> i have to wrap her in to do this stuff but you still love me don't you mum yeah. we're leaving we're leaving 